Hello, welcome back to my channel. Another tutorial session that you guys will learn today. So, paano nga ba gumawa ng thumbnail na pwede mong ilagay sa yung YouTube channel? Plus, to every video that you will upload. So, here's how, here's the step-by-step -step procedure how you will do it. Here's the sample uh, thumbnail that I just created that I'm going to share with you today. So please don't forget to like and subscribe this video and hit the notification bell for more vlogs to come. Thank you! Okay, let's start this tutorial video. I want you guys to download the uh, PixArt, the one that you're seeing right now. So that's the app that we're going to use. It's for free, you don't need to pay for it. Just please open it and click that um, violet plus sign. So we can go ahead and start editing. Pick the photo that we are going to use on your thumbnail. Make sure you guys na you have a photo that you can use for your thumbnail na, na ready. You have your own idea na. Just click the hot out, yung parang gunting, the logo. Para make sure natin na we will be able to cut it. Yung background means hindi natin isasama. Post nyo lang yan if there is an ad. So, here's what you're going to do. You're going to trace. Just like what I'm doing right now. You want to make sure na yung background is matatanggal. Then, click the top to cut out. The arrow on the upper right corner. Okay. So, nakita nyo, kailangan yung na-trace nyo is gawin yung color red lahat. So, yun yung restore button na nakikita nyo na naka-color blue sa below o sa baba. Then, you can click the preview guys para makita nyo. There you go. So, uh, you can go ahead and click the erase. You can also maximize the size guys para makontrol nyo yung uh, pag-erase. Make sure guys na when you create a thumbnail, it's appealing kasi yan yung unang-unang titingnan ng mga magsusubscribe sa inyo. Plus, kapag appealing talaga yung photo, i-click talaga yan. So, based on YouTube algorithms, make sure na appealing talaga siya para maraming mag-use dun sa mga content nyo. Okay? So, make sure that we will be able to remove the excess part of the background. There you go. So basically, it's a long process. So we want to make sure, guys, na alam nyo kung paano gawin yan. You have to be very, very careful kasi nga, uh, we don't want uh, to show the, bra the background because we will have a separate background on it. We can choose a lot of colors, banners, using pick arts or pix art. Okay. Okay, so this time we're about to finish, but we're making sure that yung very small details ay ma-cover pa rin natin siya at ma-erase pa rin natin. So, you can go ahead and use sizes, guys, if you want a bigger one or a smaller uh, for the erase part. So, what I'm using right now is the larger one, so... Yeah, that's very good if you know the details how to use this fix art. It's very easy. So right after natin guys, ma create no or ma make sure na lahat ng areas na pwede natin i-erase ay all good na. So we want to make sure as well na pipili tayo ng good background or we have a preferred color dun sa background na paggagamitan natin nitong ating thumbnail. Let's say, if you wanna talk about uh, a product that you guys are going to review, so might as well, kung anong color nung uh, i-reveal nyo, pwede nyo rin siyang itugma doon. Okay, so, yeah. At aside from that, make sure then na, uh, kasi when you upload the video, hindi talaga siya mag appear as the thumbnail that you wanted. So normally, the one that I'm doing is uh, I'm using uh, the desktop site sa cellphone, no? Ita type mo lang yung youtube.com sa isang uh, browser and then after that, 
kasi sa app hindi siya talaga mag upload eh or gagana if you will upload thumbnail never hindi talaga siya gagana kaya if you have other gadgets like a laptop or a uh, computer then might as well that's the time that you can upload your own thumbnail or edited thumbnail perhaps so i'm about to finish with he- or in here so there's a separate process guys when creating cutouts so what i'm doing is inuuna ko muna yung cutouts so that um after nan uh, to follow na lang yung background para ipipaste ko na lang whatever i did or whatever i traced so later you will see guys kung paano ko siya ginagawa at kung paano ko siya ipipaste so this is just the first process guys it's a long way to go so yeah there it is so, if ever naman um, na makover nyo na siya lahat, again guys, here's how you're, uh, you're going to save it. So, again, just click the save there on the upper right side. So, save sticker. Just need to wait. There. So, yun yung um, information na makikita nyo or color indication na na-save mo na siya save alright, there you go punta ulit tayo, click ulit natin yung plus sign since we're done, that's the only photo that we're going to use, so as you can see guys yung save photo sa taas talagang naka ano na siya, wala ng background, this time I'm looking for a color backgrounds that I can use perhaps so, I'm gonna choose the white one, and then I have to make sure na Hindi siya kasi guys yung size mismo ng YouTube, de ba? So, I'll click the YouTube sa ratio, guys. And then, click the YouTube. So, nakita niyo kung paano nagbago yung size, de ba? Or yung ratio nung magiging background or thumbnail natin. So, you can pick, guys. There's a lot of options uh, from PixArt. Make sure lang na connected kayo sa internet para makapidi kayo na ng mga, ng mga photos at backgrounds you can choose a lot of colors from there so let's say I'll just go ahead and make sure to get the white background na lang muna as of this moment so again you have to click the YouTube size okay there it is it's all white background then click the add photo there from there so this time inulit ko lang siya yung sa sizes para makita ko but I normally discard it kasi nga uh, parang nagkakaroon siya ng box so just click the photo that we want yung na edit natin kanina from there alright so as you can see guys yan na siya so hilahin nyo lang pababa para lumaki siya to make it bigger Normally, guys, on the left corner, nyo siya pwedeng ilagay. But this time, yung picture ko is naka-right yung turo. Pero pwede nyo naman siyang i-mirror, guys, if you want. If you want to do it that way. But for me, I'd like to do it muna dito sa right corner. Kasi the usual that I upload kasi is from the left corner din kasi. Okay, so from there, you can go ahead and click next or apply. This time, I'll go ahead and use brush, guys, para yung uh, details niya ma-highlight. Okay, so I'll use the brush, and then size, I'll pick color yellow, kasi yung product na i-review ko is color yellow, so might as well. Um, nilalagyan ko siya ng background, guys. That's the usual ano, thumbnail na itsura na makikita nyo dun sa mga YouTubers, guys. So, ngayon, pinapolish ko lang siya para matapos ko siya. It's actually a long way process. So, we want to make sure na every details will be highlighted para mag-appear siya as a great thumbnail once natapos na kayo mag-edit. So, there. Make sure lahat ng lines na meron pang background before ay makover. 
There you go. So once na finish na yung process na to, next thing is we can add another cut out and the title as well of our thumbnail. So after natin magawa yung highlighted na cut out, we want to make sure that we are going to insert the photo that we want to add in sa cut out na parang yung kagaya na itinuturo ko. Pero save niyo muna yan guys. There. After you may save, just click add photo again and then you may go ahead and crop that photo. Kasi I think it's with white background. So, just click the free one para ma mahila nyo siya or makat nyo siya talaga. Kasi if you will not click the free, then you will not be able to do it kung anong size yung bet nyo or gusto nyo. Okay, yan. Enlarge nyo lang para ma-highlight at makita talaga kung ano yung tinuturo nyo dyan. There. Then this time, uh, let's go ahead and type the text. That this add text. You can change the color, you can change the font, but this time I'm choosing the right font para catchy yung title niya. This time, I'm still typing in and enlarging the text that I have added. And you can pick different colors. There's a lot of colors to choose from. Change the font. Okay. Let's go ahead and add stickers. You might want to go ahead and click the stickers button there. And then you will be able to see a lot. I type in YouTube. And yeah, you can add those stickers and guys the best thing about text art it's definitely for free you don't need to subscribe or get a subscription from them because definitely um, if you are just starting YouTube then this is the right and perfect application for you so I'm just uh, filling out uh, the whole background just to make sure na hindi masasayang yung mga spaces na pwede ko pang i-add para maging catchy talaga yung aking um, thumbnail. So, this, it's just basically how you do it, guys. And again, I hope, guys, na natuto kayo kung paano gumawa ng thumbnail from scratch. So, there you go. That's the end result. You might want to go ahead and just save it. Thank you so much everyone for watching this channel and this video. I hope na natutok kayo na gumawa ng sarili niyong thumbnail para maging appealing at amazing ang mga thumbnails nyo every time na mag-upload kayo ng video. Please don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more videos to come. And don't forget to hit the notification bell para manatipin kayo sa next video ko. Thank you so much guys and I hope everyone is safe and love you all.